I've been in the real estate industry now for uh, 40 plus years. Uh, my dad was a realtor. Uh, my mom uh, was a realtor. I got my license uh, early on in life uh, and uh, had great successes as a realtor, manager, owner, uh, broker. And as a result, I've never left the industry. It's been my exclusive livelihood my entire adult life. Uh, some of my successes in the past in, the, in this industry is I, uh, in Colorado many, many years ago, um, I was the top listing agent in the state for Century 21. I uh, went on to manage a uh, real estate division for uh, a ski area in Colorado, the Durango Mountain Resort. Uh, from there, um, I moved out to, I had a, a job offer and an opportunity out in San Diego and uh, built a, uh, a small little independent into a 15 office 700 man company. Uh, one uh, top recruiter in the nation from there I became vice president of REMAX for San Diego region uh, for a big REMAX and, uh, and uh, one top recruiter in the nation. Um, then after that uh, uh, both my wife's family and my family were both from the Midwest. Uh, they were moving to Florida uh, so we decided to move to Florida. Uh, upon arriving in Florida, I bought a tiny little um, uh, Prudential franchise with 12 realtors. Uh, I built that into a large six uh, franchise, uh, uh, Prudential franchise with 200 realtors. We were doing about $300 million a year at the time, a couple thousand sales a year. Um, sold that at the very, very peak of the market. Um, people said I, that it was a genius move. I think it was more luck than genius. Uh, but I did sell it at the very peak of the market. Uh, my wife stayed on to manage their largest office, and I found myself sitting home bored. And I'd been toying, uh, well, we have been toying with the, the idea uh, of Alice and James for, for several years. Uh, I, I really believe that the technology was there to run a national real estate brokerage from a single location. Uh, as we've now proven out after four years of operations, uh, it, it absolutely can be done. But the reason I came up with the concept was, you know, in the, in the old days in real estate, uh, it used to be a 50-50 split with the broker. And, and it, that was understandable. Broker paid for all the advertising, broker paid for signs, broker paid for cards, broker paid for all the long distance phone calls, broker had the copier, Broker had the computers, broker had the scanners, broker had everything, provided everything. Well, those days have, have changed radically. Um, what has transpired is the broker pays for very few things anymore to begin with. Uh, they have the broker support, but we have that as well. Um, but they're now charging 20, 30, 40 percent in commissions, but the realtors don't need the offices anymore. And so, in respect, they really don't need the broker anymore. Um, I believe in today's world, the broker needs the realtors more than the realtor needs the broker. That is our philosophy. Our philosophy is the realtor, realtors have always been called independent contractors, but our philosophy is they are all independent business people. We are not necessarily in the real estate industry at Allison James Estates and Homes. We are in the support of the people that are in the real estate industry, and that is our realtors, and we treat them as our customer. Uh, we try to give absolute support to them, instant support, uh, and, and that is our philosophy. The realtor is our customer. We are not, uh, like I like to refer to as a, as a, uh, a Hitler broker, where we, we make them come into our offices and, and explain to us why they haven't had more sales or more listings or anything else. Um, we allow them to operate independently as long as they're honest, ethical, uh, and, and don't steal, lie, cheat. As long as they're top-notch realtors, we invite them into our company. Our average realtor is 11 years in the business with about 10 sales a year. Um, that's just way over the top of the industry averages. The realtors we're looking for are independent people. Uh, they're the ones with experience. 
they're the ones that don't need hand holding. Although we are there. I mean, you can call any realtor. You can, if you're thinking about joining us, pick up the phone and call any realtor that's with us, and and they will state that our support is outstanding. Uh, so we're there for them. But what we're looking for is the independent realtor that's been in the business for a while, that's honest and ethical, and this is their business. This is not a part-time gig for them. This is their business. Um, and, and they want somebody um, that is there when they need them and not in their way when they don't need them. And uh, that's our business philosophy, and it's, it's worked well. Another subject I'd like to, to elaborate on just a little bit is the support for the realtors. Um, we not only have the corporate office, we not only have all the technology um, so we can ha have instant communication uh, with the realtors, but we do have local brokers and state brokers for all the realtors in all the areas that we are. So they can, they can immediately contact the broker for any problem. They're always, always welcome to contact the corporate office with any problems. Um, our IT department, it's, it's, they're, they're there instantly for our people. Our accounting department's there instantly for them. Our staff people are there instantly for them. Um, I have a simple rule that nobody should have to wait for more than about seven minutes for an answer on an email or a text. Uh, so the support is, once again, call up our realtors. We have realtors upon testimonials upon testimonials of our realtors saying, you know what, your support's better than what I had in my brick and mortar environment. To a person, uh, everybody sees the advantages of what this model brings to the table. Uh, number one, uh, overhead. Uh, we do not have the extensive um, profit-killing uh, brick-and-mortar environment. Uh, that brick-and-mortar environment does not exist with us except for our single corporate office nationally. So we don't have that, that overhead that just destroys profits. Uh, number two, our brokers, because they also do not have any overhead. We take care of their expenses. Uh, their, everything they earn uh, is pure profit as well. And then the realtors, obviously, they get to keep 100% for a small fee, and they're thrilled. So with that said, and some of the people I have visited with and had the opportunity to talk to, it's a general consensus that probably in the next 10 years, maybe half the realtors in this country will be in this type of a business model. 